anything. It wasn't me. It was that little yellow guy. <laughs> he was the mastermind behind the whole thing. I tell you, I didn't do it. You can't prove anything. You better let me out of here or you'll be sorry. You'll be sorry, I tell you, I didn't do it. I didn't do it. <laughs> I... no. No. Hey, if uh, you're through, I need to get back to work. Oh, yeah, sure. This way? Yeah. Hey, thanks for taking time to show me the old jail. That was cool. Well, that was the least I could do, you taking the time to come down and all. Are you sure you didn't see anything? No, I didn't see anything. Now, think about it a second. No suspicious cars or suspicious noises? No, not a thing. And I tell you, I don't exactly feel safe knowing there's a cat burglar running around out there. Well, generally you just play it safe, but uh, cat burglars, they don't want to hurt anybody. They just want to take your stuff. Okay. Well, is there anything I could do? Well, sure. You can keep your eyes open. If you see anything, please feel free to give me a call. Okay. Thanks a lot. I will. You know, there's one more thing. Some of the neighbors reported that the cat burglar was carrying a blue velvet bag. Officer Wilkins, and you know if calling a cat burglar. Hey, it's showtime. I gotta go. Okay, David, take care. Thanks a lot. Oh no, I hope Smedley's okay. Star Wars, those crazy Star Wars. How about those Star Wars? Hey, coming at you. Hey, you drive carefully now. Hear me, you crazy nuts. And don't forget a genuine gratuity for the staff tonight. They were great. Thank you very much. Hey. Oh, my lucky marble. It's incredible. Where you been since I dropped you out the car window three years ago? Hey, Mr. Bluebird. Hey, a dollar bill. Just enough to buy me breakfast. Everything's going my way. My goodness, what have we here? A blue velvet bag full of money. Somebody stop me. <laughs> It's a travesty of justice. Whatever happened to innocent until proven guilty? Relax, just gonna ask you a few questions. Have a seat. What's this all about? When are you guys gonna let me out of here? Well, that sort of depends on you now, doesn't it? What do you mean? Well, this is how it works. You help us out, maybe we can help you out a little. Sound fair? Huh? Okay. So why don't you start off by telling me about where you found that bag? I told you, I found it by the sidewalk. Yeah, I know, I heard that, but uh, I'm really kind of finding it hard to believe that you just found a bag full of money lying on the ground. <laughs> well, if you think that's hard to believe, just before I found that, a bluebird flew past and handed me a dollar bill. <laughs> yeah, and, and just before I found that, I found my lucky marble that I lost three years ago. <laughs> yeah, when I dropped it out of the car window on my way to Alaska. Do you turn up the AC a little? Do you know what this is? I hope this isn't a test, because I don't do very well under pressure. This is your file. Listen, mister, I'm not fooling around with you. You want to start telling me what's going on? All right, all right, I did it. I admit, I just hate rewinding the tape after I watch a rented movie. I know it says to rewind, but I'm just lazy. I can't help it. <laughs> and? Yes, I ripped the tags off my pillows because they kept poking me in the eye. And I even ripped some off a couple of mattresses. Oh, <laughs> I know the tag said, do not remove under penalty of law. But they bugged me. You know what I mean? You disgust me. <laughs> you wouldn't happen to have a tissue, would you? Here, take this. <laughs> everything except the crimes. He's a professional. Okay, let's go. 
Where are we going? Your new home. All right. David D. TV, a Smedley production, will be back after these messages. What? We're on? <laughs> and now back to David D. TV. Officer Wilkins, good, I'm glad it's you. David, what can I do for you? Well, it, it was the weirdest thing. I'm, I'm walking home and I see this police car go by and a friend of mine was in it. Well, I'm not sure what I can do, but uh, tell me his name, maybe I can help you. Well, his name was Smedley. Smedley, huh? Mm-hmm, yeah. little, yellow, different. Yeah, why don't you come with me? Hello, David. Did the lamb stop crying, David? Smedley, what are you doing in there? I don't know. I was just walking along and I, I found my lucky marble. And then I wait, was... Wait, the blue one? Yeah. And then I was going... The cat's and... eye? Yes. And so I was walking... The one you it... took on vacation to Alaska and then you accidentally... Yes, that's not the point. I kept walking along and then out of nowhere, a bluebird flew by and gave me a dollar bill. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then I looked down and there was a blue velvet bag full of money. As soon as I picked it up, a hundred cop cars screeched in and picked me up. They brought me down here and locked me up and I don't even know why. Uh huh. Uh -huh. I can't believe you found that marble. Do you realize- David, that that would you get over the marble thing already? You gotta get me out of here. Okay, all right, calm down. Officer Wilkins is right over there. I'll talk to him, I'll handle everything. Chill out. Hey. Officer Wilkins. Listen, that's Smedley, and he's a friend of mine, and I can tell you- A friend? Mm-hmm. Yeah, actually, we're roommates, and- Roommates? Mm-hmm. Yeah, and I can assure you, I know him. He's done nothing wrong. There's gotta be a mistake, so we'll talk to the captain or whoever it is and clear hey, things up. Hey, where do you think you're going, Slick? I don't believe this. Smedley. Hey, Smedley! You talking to me? What? They call me Birdman. <laughs> Excuse me? Birdman. They haven't called me Smedley since I found the bird in the prison yard. The guys here in cell block D call me Birdman. Hey, Smedley, there is no cell block D. There is no bird. In fact, there is no window! Besides, you've been here a total of about 15 minutes, okay? I don't know what's going on here, but I'm figuring it's probably your fault. Psst, Smedley, did you say something about finding a blue velvet bag full of money? Yeah. Well, when I was talking to Officer Wilkins earlier, he said that an eyewitness reported that the cat burglar was carrying a blue velvet bag. Why would anyone want to steal cats? Time to do some finger painting. Hmm. 
I should excel at this. Well, this isn't any fun at all. chance. Let's make a run for it. What? Ready? One, two, Smidley. three, no. go! Smidley. Quick, the door! I can't get it. Watch out, watch out. Give it a try. Ah. No. I think they're looking. It's locked. Let's we'll try it again. It's locked! Ah, at casual. The window! The window! Get it open! I can't reach it either. Quick, the next window. They're looking, they're looking. I think I'm getting hurry. Wait, my hair's through. Let me I'm almost through. Oh, get my hair through. Yeah, yeah. I think we're making it. Okay, I'm almost there. I think it's budging. Okay, guys, come on, let's go. Yeah. All right. Okay. Sir, we just checked Smedley's fingerprints. I think you should take a look. <laughs> my, my, my. Looks like we finally netted the elusive cat burglar. It's time to bring charges. David? What? Do you have any birdseed on you? No. David? What? You wouldn't happen to have any earthworms on you, would you? Could you just cool it with a little bird thing? David? What? How many hot dogs? There is no bird! I meant for me! I'm starving! Haven't they fed you since you've been in here? Yeah, but I gave all my bread and water to Belvedere. And he still looks hungry! Oh, oh shit, someone's coming. Oh, Officer Wilkins, thank goodness it's you. Tell me, what is going on? Well, it appears your friend Smedley here is a cat burglar. What? No, no, I've known him a long time and uh, he is no criminal. Are you? I've never stolen a cat in my life. Now, he can't even steal second base. <laughs> Save it for the judge. Okay, all right. What about the guy who looks like a cat? Who? Him! That guy! Okay, all right, what about me? Well, you're under arrest too. What? What for? Well, harboring a fugitive, accessory after the fact, and I'm sure I can think up a few more. Mm. David, I am so disappointed in you. How could you? Einstein, he's talking about you. You're the fugitive. Cool. All right, wait, 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 wait. The only evidence you have on him is that he was caught holding the bag, right? No, that's not all. We have a fingerprint man. Well, that's gotta be a mistake. There's gotta be something we can do here. Well, the best thing for your little pal to do is just to come clean, a full confession. But I didn't take any cats, honest. Well, how about taking a lie detector test? Test? But, but, but I don't do well under pressure. Oh, wait, wait, Smedley, that could be our answer. You take the lie detector test and you show them we're not guilty. How about it? We're coming back with more David DTV right after these messages.
And now, back to more David D. TV. Hey, Smidley, you think that sounded like me? You know, you could save an innocent guy a lot of trouble if you just tell him the truth. What are you talking about? <laughs> tell them you're the cat burglar. But I'm not. Uh, yes, you are. Am not. Oh, come on. All right, Smedley. Now, what we're going to do is I'm going to ask you a series of questions. What I need you to do is simply answer yes or no. Do you understand? What? What do you mean? What did, what did you say or what did I mean? I mean, I don't understand the question. Well, which question, the first one or the second one? Which was the first one again? OK. Never mind. Just say yes or no to everything I say. You got it? Got what? Are you the cat burglar? No. Are you sure you've never been a cat burglar? No. Are you sure you're not now or you've never been a cat burglar? Okay, it's me. <laughs> okay, would you like to tell us all about it? I didn't mean to. It just crawled into my backpack when I wasn't looking. It was in there a half a day before I found out. It was all just a mistake. Are you saying that money crawled into your backpack by itself? Money? I'm talking about the neighbor's cat. I didn't mean to steal it, honest. I tried to take it back, but it, it just jumped out of the backpack and crawled under a car. Under a car? Yeah, I felt so bad. I went under the car after it, but it, it crawled up into the engine. You went under the car after it? Sure, I mean, even though it wasn't my fault, I didn't want that sweet kid next door to lose his cat. It was his best friend. So I tried to crawl up into the engine after it. Well, that sure was dangerous. What if someone started the engine? You'd end up hanging onto the bottom of a hot car for two days while they drove to Yosemite. Dirt flying in your eyes, which you can't blink. Every grisly road kill that passed under that car was a reminder that you were only inches away from certain death. You did that for your neighbor's cat? Yep, I did it for my neighbor. That cat was his pride and joy. His little snowball. Snowball. My little snowball. Jerry? I had no idea you tried to save my cat. I thought she just ran away. I was traumatized. I love that cat. You gotta let this little guy go. He didn't do it. I'm the cat burglar. You? You? Duh. I can't let this guy take the rap for me. He's a good American and a cat lover. Sorry, pal. We've already got his fingerprints. Those are my fingerprints. I switched them when you weren't looking. Well, what do you think? Well, I thought he was just playing dumb, but he wasn't. You're free to go. Oh, yes. OK, let's go. Jerry, I know it's been a long time, but tell me, why steal cats? Oh, Smedley, cat burglars steal money and stuff from people's houses. They don't steal cats. That was his bag of stolen money that you found. Is this true, Jerry? <laughs> yes. Ooh, you're going away for a long time. Listen, I'm sorry I couldn't save your cat, and I know that no one can ever replace her, but maybe after all these years, it's time for a new friend. You mean? Yes. I want you to take care of my bird, Belvedere. I'm not worthy. 
There is no bird. <sighs> this is ridiculous. Come on, let's go. So long, Birdman. You gonna need some bird seed for that? If Smedley doesn't break anything, we'll be back with more after this. We're back. More David D. TV. Ah, freedom. Man, doesn't it feel good to be out of jail? Yep, the sun's shining, the birds are singing, and no cats. <laughs> you got that one right. Man, what a strange day this was. It was just bizarre. What do you think you learned from all this, Medley? Hmm, that love is the most powerful force in all the universe. That's good, but I was thinking more like truth conquers all. Now, what about crime doesn't pay? Good, yeah, or if you got your health, You've got everything. Yeah, or, or haste makes waste. You know, wait a minute. Wh why are we always responsible for finding the greater meaning in everything? Why can't we all just get along? I think it's the FCC. Yeah, that's true. Oh, we did learn something about how the police department works. Well, there you go. That's exactly. it. Exactly. That's, that's the whole thing. The polygraph guy. Yeah, the, the holding cell. The key and the, the lock. The, and the interrogation room. That's oh, it. There you Absolutely. go. Absolutely. Let's get out of here. <laughs> yeah, after you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think I pulled something. Some of the neighbors reported seeing a cat burglar. Cat burglar. Woo! We were there. Cat burglar. Oh. You know, there's one more thing. Some of the neighbors reported a cat burglar. I can't say burglar anymore. Uh oh. Uh oh. We've hit. We've hit that. Don't. Officer Wilkins. <laughs> I had no idea you tried to save her. <laughs> but, but tell me something. You know what? I have a line here, but you know what? I, I forgot what it was. <laughs> but beside that, we can't see Officer Wilkins at right all. Now. <laughs> I want you to take care of my bird, Belvedere. I'm not worthy. Come on. Let's go. Wait a minute. Were you annoyed because there is no bird? <laughs> yes. Did that annoy you? Hmm? Did that annoy you? Hey! Hey! Look at that! I brought my dog! Hey, you drive safely now! You hear me, you crazy nut? My dog is back! <laughs> 